Brothers and sisters, thank you for coming today. Thank you for your presence, and may all abound to the glory of God. Before we leave, could it be possible that there would be somebody here today who does not know this Christ of whom we speak? Could it be here that there would be somebody here today who says, what must I do to be saved? You've come in here and the burden of your sin is weighing you down. You're aware of your stance before the Lord, guilty and condemned before Him. And you hear us speak of grace and love and joy and hope. Today, you say, what must I do to be saved? Maybe you're religious, but not saved. And today, I say to you the same thing that the Apostle Paul said to a a jailer over 2,000, almost 2,000 years ago. He said, believe on the Lord Jesus Christ and you too will be saved. Brothers, believe on the Lord Jesus Christ. Trust in Him. Turn from your sin and believe, and you too will be saved. May the Lord add His blessing to this to this meeting today. We're going to go to the cemetery now. Those of you who've come uh, from far away, family and friends, there's going to be a a meal back here at the church. We sure would love to have you to, to come. Uh, those of you, again, out-of-town guests and family, we want to be uh, here together with you for some time of fellowship. We're going to turn this time now over to the funeral director. Please wait for his instructions, and uh, he'll tell you where to go from here.